Hello, I'm Leroy James Clampett. I'm Cam Chatterton. My name is Jimmy Mattia. I'm Fraser McDonald. The winners of the Smoke Free Rock Quest 2010 are the Good Fun. Winning the Smoke Free Rock Quest last year felt amazing. One of the best feelings I've ever felt. It was a lot of relief as well. All this hard work and it actually paid off. Definitely one of the best moments of my life. And the crowd was so sweet. We had a few presents and lollies to give them. All our family and friends were there because it was held in Hamilton. It was probably the best concert we've ever done. Eh? Since winning the Smoke Free Rock Quest, it's been a massive year. There's been a lot going on. We've had heaps of fun. We've made two videos now. And then the Little Sin video, we like played in front of a big green screen with just like cardboard instruments. Oh, it was pretty awkward because he was just standing in front of a green screen by herself. The video ended up so sweet. It's probably one of my favourite things we've done. Put it on YouTube and now it's got 127,000 views. We've had like quite a few big gigs out there, I guess. We played at Mardi Gras up at Oaku. That was pretty big. There was like 7,000 people or something. Heaps of TV appearances, a couple of photo shoots. He played on ZM and The Edge. A couple of people the other day asked for an autograph and stuff. We're pretty much living the rock and roll lifestyle. Part of our prize was to go to Fiji. We got to do like heaps of cool stuff. Jet skis, paragliding, swimming. We thought our parents would have to come, but it was just us four. <laughs> Chilling in Fiji alone. And it was schoolies week in Australia, so all the people who had left school go to Fiji and have a party pretty much, and we were just the band. Australians are pretty crazy. It was just a beautiful place to play, really relaxed, really hot. I'll never forget those times. So everyone in the band's just been really busy, eh? We've all got some pretty cool stuff happening outside the band. Praises a world-renowned Rubik's Cube person. Leroy started a lawn mowing business. I've been herding a couple of sheep. Cam started bird watching. Oh, poo kicker. If you work as hard as I did at school, kids, you could be just like me. G'day, I'm Matt Eland, and I work for the Smoke Free Rock West. As part of the prize of winning the Smoke Free Rock West, the good fun got to be managed by me. Matt Eland, he's an awesome. I like how he's quite young and hip, you know, we can relate. The good fun, they were a good bunch of guys to work with actually. They just took every opportunity that came their way and really ran with it. I was there to sort of make sure that they weren't swamped with a bunch of little tasks. He's helped us heaps. Yeah, he's helped set us up in gigs and photo shoots and whatnot. He takes us out and looks after us, puts us in hotels and stuff. Always feeds us and makes sure we're on time and stuff. It's definitely helped us out. They've won, they've gone away, they've worked hard and they've gotten better and better and they can fit it with the rest of them. So we're here at the Founders Theatre, 2011 this time. This is where it all started out. This is where we came second last year in the regionals and we went on to win the finals here. One of the coolest things that we've seen this year was having the Good Fun back on the stage where they won the national final. Back in their hometown, that was exciting. It was fun to watch. You could see that they've progressed a lot. To be successful in the Rock Quest, I think you need to um, be yourself and have fun on stage. Don't try too hard, but um, definitely try a little bit. I see heaps of fans that are real competitive about it. Just do what you want to do, man. Practice hard and it will pay off in the end. The whole experience of Rock Quest has just been unreal for us, eh? Looking back, it's just such a good deal, such a good gig. The future plans for the good fun, just playing as many shows as possible, recording more singles and hopefully going on our first tour, maybe getting signed and leaving the country. They're young, they're an exciting band. We're all really tight mates. That'll never change. The future for the good fun is pretty bright. We've got songs just popping out of our heads all the time. Everyone, like Cam and Fraser and Jimmy, they all have little ideas and they just need somewhere to go. Look at us, we thought we were a little prongy band, but now we have 130,000 hits on YouTube.